Today, I'll show you how to log in to your router using default login IP address. 192.168.31.1 Need to configure your router or modem but don't know how to access the settings. Today, I'll show you how to log in using 192.168.31.1. Let's get started. Step 1. Find your router's default credentials. Flip your router and look for a sticker, default IP address and default username password along with default Wi-Fi SSID and password. Step 2. Connection with router wired or Wi-Fi. For routers and modems, connect your computer to the device via Wi-Fi or Ethernet cable. Step 3. Access router settings from web browser. Power on your router if already not power on and open a browser. In the address bar, type exactly 192.168.31.1, then press enter. You'll see the router's login page. Enter the default username and password, check your router's label. Most use default username and password as admin. Once logged in, you'll see the router's status page with full settings menu. To change wireless name and password, go to Settings then Wi-Fi Settings from from top menu, then change SSID name and create a new Wi-Fi name for your network. If your router support dual band, change Wi-Fi SSID for 2.4 GHz and 5.8 GHz both bands. To change Wi-Fi password, choose latest security type and create a stronger password. After change settings, press Apply Changes and wait while router rebooting or saving settings. If you're having trouble logging to router settings, follow the troubleshooting steps. IP address not working or page not loading? Check your connection or try confirm 192.168.31.1 is your router's correct IP. Disable VPNs or proxy connections. Clear your browser cache. Wrong username or password. If you forget your router password, just reset the router using reset button. Locate reset button or reset whole backside or front side of router or modem. Power on your router and hold button for 10 seconds and release when router LED light turn off and router will restart. And that's it. Now you can log into your Wi-Fi router or modem using 192.168. .31.1 and take control of your network. If you found this guide helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe channel. Thanks for watching.